Examision is a French small company. We are working on optronic systems, mainly for two applications. The first one is embedded optronics for land vehicles and vessels. And the second one is border surveillance and sensitive site surveillance. So just here you have a product range dedicated on um, targeting and observation surveillance for both naval and land military vehicles. So the product integrates thermal cameras, visible camera, laser rangefinder. It's totally qualified to uh, military environment. And right now, this product is uh, embedded on uh, weapon system, remote weapon systems. So we are uh, presenting uh, our uh, range of countermeasure for airborne platforms and for uh, land forces. Okay, so uh, we have a broad range of countermeasure solutions that we can address for uh, Polish platforms such as Rosomac, uh, PT-91, uh, uh, T-72, or for the so-called VIP helicopters of the Black Hawk of uh, PZDL uh, Milec. Here you can find uh, as a uh, premiere here uh, in uh, Poland uh, Expo, uh, the Galix uh, automated obscurity system. So it's a complete uh, system, turnkey system from detection to reaction. So we are able to detect all kind of uh, IR and laser uh, guided threats such as a laser designator, laser beam uh, rider, or uh, laser guided bomb, for example. So uh, we can use uh, so uh, detection uh, with a sensor, uh, uh, so laser sensor, and uh, we use the uh, reaction through the uh, control unit. Uh, we can uh, be integrated with the battle management system of uh, the armored vehicle and uh, so we can detect uh, the threat. Then uh, we can uh, react within one second with a full broadband uh, masking effect. So on uh, this edition of MSPO, uh, we are exhibiting uh, our new power pack for PT-91 T-72. Uh, coupled to the Scania engine. This power pack was also exhibited last year. Uh, but this year uh, we are promoting uh, new options and also new applications. So this power pack is also fitting the new uh, tank PT-16 presented by Buma Wabende. Uh, we have an additional level of power of 1090 horsepower. Uh, so meaning three possibilities on the engine concerning the power, 1000, 1090, and 1200 horsepower. So in fact, we are presenting a new way of coupling uh, of the output of the transmission, uh, allowing a quick remove of the power pack, even on the field. The activation of the coupling is done manually. It was done hydraulically in the past. So this uh, manual activation allows a much quicker replacement of the power pack. We are also exhibiting uh, the driver station, including the new control, the new gear selector. Uh, with a specific control, with different driving modes that, can, that I can de describe to you. So we are showing here uh, all the control uh, controlling the power pack. So the steering wheel for the steering of the vehicle uh, with the main display. On the steering wheel there are two buttons allowing manual change of gear. An additional display uh, gives uh, extra information to the driver and can be moved outside when the driver is driving with the head outside. On, on the right, a gear selector with uh, the forward uh, gear, reverse gear, pivot, several modes of uh, gear change and the control of the fan. The core business of X-Blue is uh, inertial navigation, so both uh, naval and uh, land application for defense. But in fact, X-Blue is coming from civil market. In the civil market, X-Blue uh, um, is a, a, a player in a subsea navigation, especially for offshore market, also hydrography, and then gradually moved to, uh, to 
to defense, naval defense first. Now it's blue is uh, considered to be a leader in naval defense. And now we are moving to land defense uh, with some successes that we get in the recent years. And we expect, of course, to grow our market share in this domain. Uh, in MSP, we are showcasing, we are showing the uh, stabilized platform, but um, I would rather speak about our inertial navigation system family for land defense. So we have a range of product from uh, Vega, which is the most performing, which is competing against the, the best uh, system in the, in the world, but with something new that is using the fiber optical gyro technology. And uh, this fiber optical gyro technology is the technology of tomorrow. Because, uh, for example, in naval defense, we are the performance is far above what is reached today uh, with the laser gyro technology. And also, there is a big, big advantage, is that is, there is no maintenance. Uh, it's, um, once you install your system in your vehicle or your vessel, uh, you don't need to uh, recalibrate uh, or make any um, periodic maintenance. You can forget it for 15 years and then it will still work. So Zodiac Aerospace is a large corpor French corporation. Uh, we do have uh, more than 35,000 employees all around the world. It's a worldwide corporation. We do uh, have uh, sales revenue over 5 billion, uh, uh, 5 billion uh, euro yearly. Uh, we are one of the top 10 uh, large uh, uh, aerospace equipment manufacturers, mostly in commercial aviation, but we do have some military business and this is the reason of our presence here in Poland uh, on the military show. Um, we are well famous for, for seats uh, as a seats manufacturer, but we do uh, all what is in the, within the cabin of commercial aviation, uh, from the cockpit uh, to the, the, the uh, rear of the, of the aircraft, we can uh, arrange a full cabin uh, to the customer needs. For my uh, business line, the parachute is most, mostly a military uh, uh, focus and, and, and a military uh, customer. Uh, I'm presenting here and introducing uh, the uh, latest product for Special Forces. Uh, we were just awarded by the French uh, forces for, uh, uh, to provide them with the most advanced uh, uh, high altitude free fall system equipping, uh, uh, it's a full system that equipped uh, the French forces from uh, uh, the parachute itself, the navigation system, uh, all the uh, clothing of the, of the troopers, so it uh, uh, it's, will be the most advanced system uh, in, in the world, so we, we are very proud of this competition, having won this competition.